So the last time that we did a YouTube video, we had released two collections into 2021. And a lot, quite a bit has happened since then. We did a collection in April called Industry Plant, which was my least favorite collection of 2021, but it did fine, it did well. I was really happy with how the editorial finished. We got to work with Tyler Mazaheri and Logan Rice on a really cool video that I was most proud of. I was more proud of the media than the actual product. This is good though. <laughs> this is yeah, no, this stuff is good. What I was gonna say is like, you don't get that much. Like, Tell me a little bit about yourself. So, uh, I'm, uh, I'm originally from the Republic of Benin in West Africa. Been in the US for like five years. I'm a fashion enthusiast. You can check my Instagram, it's O C H O U M A R E. So I just deposit my pay. So I'm a homemade designer. You know, I'm the person with the vision. Now I look at you right now, I'm like, those pants that look so fucking different. So now let's get down to business. <laughs> It's important for me to like create product that, you know, that 16 year old Zach could buy and 17 year old Zach could buy. Like I would never want to abandon sort of like that group of people. Because I think the moment, or I don't know, I just like, like love the youth. Like I, I always want that to be, you know, part of our identity. Yep. Great. And whatever else we want to move, um, we'll just put in this area. Exactly. Yes. Great. Thank you so much. How can I be streetwear, Zach, but, you know, have these products that allow, you know, this look to make me look you know, like an adult, or I don't know if adult's the right word, but just like, like, like gateway luxury drugs, if that makes sense. Eh? Yeah. Which one do you like the best? I like the uh, bag the best, so maybe that's Or do you think the world college the SB shows are Or split up, is what it is. Yeah, that's pretty crazy. Welcome. What's up? Nice to meet you. You too. See you. How are you? What's up, fellas? Uh, we're kind of rocking and rolling in here. Check out the space. You guys are good to roll in. Um, which one do you like better? Though? I like the back ones, but Berks will do the best. So I think Berks. Do you think Berks? The thing that I'm I'm excited for personally is definitely that like transitional wardrobe, right? It's like the mules are a two hundred dollar slipper. But like you could wear it with slacks and all of a sudden you are somewhat dressed up.
who did a collaboration with the NBA or NBA League Fits. It was a, I'd say like a childhood dream. League Fits was this Instagram page that started I think three or four years ago where there was emphasis purely on taking pictures of NBA players walking through the tunnel before games. The guy that runs it, his name is Ian, and he was a fan of the brand. He was um, exposed to us through mutual friends and uh, reached out about a project. And I, I basically just didn't hesitate and pitched them two products. So dyed, printed it, and shipped it to the players in three weeks. The opportunity to get to send clothes to you know, players who I see, you know, as a kid, probably closer to like a mythological creature than like a human being. For that to be like one point away for me doesn't feel, it's like, it, I, I can't even really frame it. It just doesn't feel real in a way. I think this is the right way. I'm not sure though. Someone said like you're only as important as your cosine or, or that you are your cosine. So like as we've grown, there's been opportunities for us to like collaborate and, and work with other artists or other brands and whatnot. And I've always wanted to date up, you know? Like I know that I'm a freshman or a young kid in this sort of like metaphorical high school that is fashion or the entertainment industry or whatever framing works but like for me i was like okay like if we're going to like lend our audience or our signature or our photography or our product design we want it to look like we are dating out of our league you know and so adidas you know this is a project that was in my dorm room a few years ago and we have had no collaboration. So for Adidas to be our first like a date, I guess you'd say, I think, you know, I hope people felt like we were dating out of our league a little bit. It was bizarre to me, like how many hands were on, so, like the processes to put on a pop-up shop that featured product. There's there's so many steps before product can be connected to people. And that's just different, you know? It's good for some things and it's, it's bad for others, I think is how I'd explain it. It's not as direct of a connection to people, but uh, it's fucking Adidas, so. <laughs> We're built to interact directly. We, we build the product and present it directly to our consumer. We, we interact directly with our consumer. We hang out with our consumer. And so there is like a direct energy exchange almost. And uh, in those scenarios, it's a little bit more disconnected. There's more, more moments for approval. And I think that has to exist as things become as the stakes get higher, maybe, just to protect all parties involved. This is sick. The eyes of Howard? I had this for like two years. Bro. What are you putting on it? The OG. I don't know if I should do the front or the back. I mean, it might kind of fuck up around the seams, but that might be kind of hard. So on the back. Yeah, yeah, whatever you prefer. It will be cleaner on the back. Like the sort of direct access that we've created to people that I do believe like genuinely care it feels the most important. What do you want to do? Uh, damn. Light skin, can I'm having fun with my Barbie. I keep barley in my bladder. Matter of fact, please don't play me. Please don't hate me. I know you won't struggle if you have to replace me. I'm 
trapped in my head, stuck stumbling over my words I can't comprehend my own. I'm struggling to put together pieces. Shattered in a tattered haze of smoke. The only reason I ain't splattered red paint on my walls is because I really wanted my security deposit back. Put the beat back on. Gotta save, gotta save this money, gotta save this bread. Artists and rolls and baguettes in my head. Shed too many tears, intrusive thoughts from too many beers. I might just steer in the oncoming. It'll be a hot day in heaven when you find where your heart is And come to find it finishes exactly where you started Departed out of nervousness, shaking and alone Addicted to pornography and thousand dollar phones These Birkin bags and burdened f***s Trending topics is all we have I guess I...